Hello guys and welcome to this tutorial. Um, today I'm going to show you how to denoise your render passes. Uh, i show you the, the, the problem really quick. So sometimes you have like uh, a render with many r render passes like this, um, but it doesn't get denoised. You don't need to combine your render passes after in, in compositing and you want to combine them without uh, having like troubles with the with the uh, with the noise in the render passes, so you have a denoise beauty that's gonna denoise, but your render layers are not getting denoised. That's an issue uh, because the render uh, the render engine is only uh, Octane is only going to denoise your beauty render. But in the newest version of uh, Octane Render twenty uh, twenty twenty five. Um, you can denoise your render passes. Um, so I was searching for the solution and uh, the problem is you can't find like a tutorial on YouTube or something. So I ran into this uh, like blog post from uh, someone. So maybe I can link it to the description and you get this project file and I looked a little bit more into it. Um, that's this project file right here. And as you can see, uh, if I start it, you have like this output. Um, but I don't know why, but this dude makes it a little bit brighter. Uh, so this is the ambient light and it gets a little bit brighter. So um, I watched into the, the node editor and I tried to get some, uh, yeah, get some ideas how this works. And uh, yeah, that's how I get to the solution. So I show you how to how to do this without the color correction and everything. You don't need it really. You just need to to have like uh, two or three nodes. So as you can see, I have the I have already some of them set it up. So now I'm gonna show you how to, how it works. Ah, you can see some some artifacts in the volume, but uh, also what um, you gotta get is like. Uh, uh, a real-time uh, denoiser. So now I'm going to show you how, the, how it works. You don't need like uh, to denoise the beauty. Uh, so if you set up the your AOV, so you have like the light passes and everything right here. Um, as example, you can go for like lights, and uh, you don't need to set up this also. That's uh, not important. You just need to make sure that you have like uh, the light ID pass in here. So you going to the render AOV manager and go to the node editor. I'll click directly in here, like uh, here, yes. And as you can see, you can go to uh, add an input, and you get the compositing AOV. So now we have all our render passes in here, and we have. Uh, this little setup. I can show you how it works. That's not a problem. So you go to layer group and you need to make this for every every uh, render pass. Uh, layer AOV group, you add two layers. You add in the noise, open image denoiser, plug it in the first one and go for an AOV uh, output, I guess. No, it was an AOV, render AOV, I guess, yeah. Right, and then you go to denoised, denoised albedo, and you're going to duplicate it and go for the denoised, denoised normal, and you plug it in here. And the second layer, I put it into, ah, you need an output AOV. Plug it in here and go for this one. Yeah, exactly. This is how it works. And then you go to your uh, render layer path so you need an uh, wait the second one was ah yeah it's also an output aov uh, no. AOV. Uh, render aov yeah render aov and then you put in your light passes so you need to do make sure you make this with every layer so we go now for something that I don't have already, this is the light IP ID pass three. Uh, yes. So we're going for.
for uh, light, light ID path three. And now we have everything that has the ID three in uh, one uh, denoised layer. So this is how it works. You just need to, you just need to make a, uh, uh, import your denoised albedo and your normal albedo, put it in the open image denoiser with a layer uh, and your uh, light ID pass, put it in this layer AOV and then plug it in here. If you want to make some color correction stuff, you can also go for gamma correction, something like this, but you don't need to, you don't need to. So if you plug it like, uh, plug it like this, you have like the, the, uh, just the render render layer with the with the denoised uh, open image denoiser. Yeah, that's it.